What's up guys, Ankle Spangin here, and today we are playing as Heimer Dudonger in the top lane. And this will be the ultimate cheese strategy that I just wanted to try because it sounded fun. And I'm going to show you, the handsome viewer, how we're going to do it today. So we will be against a Riven today, and as you may be able to see, I am running Grasp of the Undying. All part of the plan. So you just sit back, buckle up, and get ready to watch it. To watch it happen. Because this is gonna be good. And let's go ahead and get a turret set up right here. So let's get right into this game. Let me just explain to you guys the strategy right now. Because the strategy is not a... Uh, a classic strategy to say the least. Sorry, I just kind of looked over at my camera. I'm like, oh wow, I'm so white. But, you know, that's not really surprising. Um, anyways, the strategy is we're going Banner of Command and Zerat Portal. That's what we're doing in this game. Uh, that's what we're going to do. I apologize if it's not the most exciting thing you've ever seen, but I'm going to have a good time doing it. So that is the play. Wait. Do my turrets die as they shoot? Is that just something I never noticed? Or what's what's going on here? What's going on here? Whatever. It doesn't matter. Get grasp of the undying. That's going to be... Wow, look at that damage going off on Riven. Nicely done. All right, throw a turret down right there. No, that definitely wasn't the case. I was just tripping. Okay. I'm glad I was just tripping there because that would have been... That would have been just catastrophic for the plan if my turrets like had this shadow update that I never knew about and they just died every now and then after shooting <laughs> shots for a little bit. But let's see, it looks like their jungler is a Graves. So that is actually a champion that can gank me. Um, regardless though, we're not going to worry about that. We're just going to keep on chilling, keep on uh, having a grand old time and getting as much CS as we can while just chilling out. <laughs> I don't foresee myself getting, uh, you know, a lot of kills in this lane. Oh god! Oh god! Okay, we're out. Sorry, I just had to get the grass peeling and dying off on her. So, how about, uh, as they say, another one. So, throw down that third turret right there, baby. Get that in there. Look at this damage! What are you gonna do, Riven? What are you gonna do? She just got anal. So it looks like the trifecta of turrets are out and on the move. Getting us some good minions, getting us some good damage. And now, well, <laughs> sit back, let them do the work. So, I don't know if I want to go for Zerat first, or if I want to go for a Banner of Command first. I cannot decide, honestly, but I don't see myself really going uh, really going wrong no matter how I look at it so mm, yeah grasp of the undying and we'll go ahead and, oh that laser baby so see if we can throw some abilities and grenados at her we got to keep ourselves warded up here because naturally as the younger we are going to be pushing very hard um, not necessarily pushing the tower very hard but pushing very hard in through the lane. So I'll just set my turret line a little further back now and see if we can uh, ooh, get that grasp of the undying going off there, baby. And actually, my turret's auto-attacking things. It actually keeps me in combat. So that's kind of cool. Now let's go ahead and bop that grasp of the undying. Get some. Get some, baby. So, yeah. For some reason, this is so satisfying to just, like, go against a Riven that can't do anything to me. <laughs> this is... That's exactly what's making this satisfying right now. It's just the fact that we're against a Riven that is absolutely helpless. Because, you know, nothing against my viewers that play Riven, but, uh... <laughs> if you're a Riven player, my friend... Wowie wow. Let's go ahead and set up that third turret again. Get it back up and keep on <laughs> just shoving. Just shoving it in there. Pushing harder than a pregnant lady, as the saying goes. Is my passive still just HP regen? It is, right? Yeah. 
Wait, 15 per 5 seconds? That's so much! Bonk. Oh god! Oh god! Oh, never mind. She just got... <laughs> She's trying to trade with the donger, and she just got the donger dicking of a lifetime. Never mind. Get annihilated. But now we are level 6. We do have the upgrade. If you guys don't know how Heimer's ultimate works, whenever you use it, the next one of your three basic abilities you use will be buffed. Uh, the rockets is an upgraded like super rocket. It shoots a big like rocket barrage. The uh, ultimate on the grenade, it shoots a grenade that does more damage. I believe explodes in a bounce or like a bigger area, and also bounces three times. And then the ultimate with your turret uh, sets up a mega turret. So. Not really surprising in any way there. And it looks like Riven, now that she is, <laughs> she went back, teleported back, and, you know, she went back, grabbed a hex drinker, and teleported back up here. Um, honestly, she's probably going to start getting real aggressive on us now, I could, uh, I imagine. So, oh, get stunned on, son. And, wow, never mind. She's just going to take a bunch of damage, and that's going to be that. So, see you later. Looks like my, or one of my other turrets going to go down again. And where are we at? Honestly, I'm missing a lot of CS because I'm garbage. I do have graves coming up here. And let's see. Whoa. Kha'Zix making that leap of faith towards him. Not going to be doing anything, though. <laughs> Holy mackerel. Those lasers just going through the minions just absolutely decimates them. That's awesome. Let's see here. Where's Riven? Where's she at? Where's this helpless little girl at? There she is. There she is. It looks like she threw a pink in there. So, I'm going to go ahead and ping that. Say pink. Just so, uh, just so Kha'Zix knows in case, for whatever crazy reason, he wants to try and dive. Uh, which, if he does, that's honestly not going to be the best idea on his part. But, some people are... Uh, into those crazy plays, so get grass with the undying right there, and let's well, just keep on chilling. This is the most passive thing I've ever done. For some reason, I'm still really enjoying it. Usually, I don't sit here and think to myself, "Oh, you know what? Let's just have a good time." You know, let's just have a good time, just relaxing. It's gonna be nice and easy, and we're gonna. It's just, it's just gonna be great. So apparently. Riven sat here and thought she could just kill my turret and be scotch free after, uh, you know, chilling. But that is not the case. So hang on, let's see here. This. I think I'm actually going to level up my grenade second here because if I'm going for like a strategy where I just want to um, sit here and push, then the, pr the more defensive ability, which is my grenade, being on a shorter cooldown is actually going to help a decent amount. So. We'll go with that. Throw our net or throw our turret up here again. And we'll go get another grasp of the undying bonk right there. And throw that W out there. And is it time for us to back yet? Can we get our full banner command? 2900. How much is Zerat Portal? 2700. So, we are actually nearing the cost for those items. Let's go ahead and get some potions. Or not potions, but a ward in this bitch. So far, so good. And it looks like, oh, we do still have that CS lead. So good job, us. I'll go. Ooh, oh God. Okay, got it. I was getting a little nervous there that I wasn't gonna get those minions. So you know, good thing we did. Good thing we did. So keep ourselves in combat here. Just make sure that grasp of the undying will be up. Go ahead and just. Oh, I'm not gonna get her there. Come on. Bonk. Uh oh. Uh oh. It looks like she wants to go in on us. Now let's go ahead and drop that. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Riven, no flash. Riven, no hex drinker. Riven, no nothing. Riven, no sums or hex. So, Riven trying to make a big balls play there. We'll just get dicked, and there's the flash. There's the kill. Easy pickup for Kai Zix. Even though there was a pink in there, get that pink, please. Get the okay. Oh, Graves incoming. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and grab our Zerat portal now. 
because I think the Zerat portal will be much more useful for us as an early item. Because on top of some tankiness, it'll also give us actually a little more life regen and obviously the active. So what the active will do is it'll actually give us our pushing power to be able to, um, you know, really, really push into the tower here. So what we're going to do is the more I sit here and think about this, the more I sit here and think about this, the better it works. Because what we're going to do is we're going to set our Zerat portal up probably in this bush. So even if it starts swinging towards my side, I can still protect it. So, actually, yeah, let's just do it right here. So Zerat portal is now in here, and it will help us push. It will do some damage to the turret. <laughs> wow. This is the cheesiest thing I've ever done, dude. <laughs> and I could not be happier about it. So look at those Zerat, or little Zots, as they're called, going. Uh-oh, gonna go ahead and drop my flash, and let's see. What's up, Graves? What's up, bitch? That's gonna be, yeah, one kill right there. So the 1v2 will be picking it up, and the Zerats live on as do all of my turrets, and in exchange, all I had to use was my flash. So, <laughs> what the fuck, dude? You know, I would feel bad if this was anyone but a Riven, but since it's a Riven, I don't feel bad. Not even, not even a little bit, actually, do I feel bad. So, <laughs> that poor Graves, though, came into my lane, he's like, oh yeah, we're gonna get this donger. I and mean, then he just gets, he literally got dongered in the ass. Oh, man. You poor soul. All right. <laughs> so the little Zosh is bleh. Just gonna, yeah, come on, do it. Bleh. There it is. This is so funny. <laughs> I might actually uh, start utilizing this strategy a bit more. <laughs> I just feel... I don't know how else to put it. I just feel so, so menacing. It's, it's such a good feeling. Like, this tower is almost down, and I'm doing next to nothing about it. Like, oh no, oh no. Hey, hey, come on, come on. We can talk. Hey, what's that? What's that? You wanna, you wanna talk? All right, do it. Come on, Riven. Come on, fight me. You didn't really fight me there. So let's see, wow, just throw that stun out, gonna miss, but Riven's ultimate not gonna do anything, and the Zerats will take that first turret for us. So first turret down, ultimate has been upgraded, and let's see here, it is about time for us to, uh-oh, uh-oh, go ahead and see what we can do here, it looks like he wants to do this again, and actually, instead of dropping my ultimate here, I'm just gonna cancel it and leave it up again so time to reposition my turrets so we'll drop these a little further in the lane so Riven has a uh, bit of a harder time pushing back out and you know we gotta we gotta protect the uh, the more forward location so what's up Graves you still trying to get a gank off of me little boy huh you still want to do something cuz you ain't you ain't gonna do shit come on and whoop do it, Graves. Come on. Do it. Fight me. <laughs> Fight me. Alright, let's go ahead and get rid of this pink ward real fast. Because both of them are just stuck way far away from, uh, from the location. We'll set our third turret down here. And keep on slowly, slowly moving this wave of turrets up. So Kha'Zix is in the mix. Let's go ahead and just... Uh, oh. I was going to try and set down a big turret right in his face but then he flashed out <laughs> so wait what the fuck look at it go look at <laughs> what what is that turret doing you silly turret that's not what you're supposed to do all right whatever he's doing his best so let's see the zarat from there does that reach this turret and i don't know We'll see on this next one, does it? And it does! Alright. We all clear, baby. It looks like, uh-oh. Uh-oh, gonna go ahead and set down the big turret. 
And it looks like we got Graves in here too. What are you doing, Gravy? What are you doing? Get annihilated! And no! We're gonna go down. That's gonna be our first death right there. But 2-1-0, and oh, it looks like we're gonna have to just, oh darn, go back with another 2,600 gold here and grab both components of our Banner of Command. So the Zerat portal will still actually help us push, but she is gonna make it through there in time. But, but wait, there's more. My Zerat portal will be back up by the time I get back to lane. So like, even better, right? <laughs> so let's see, she rushed the mob Mount Mortius. Not a bad idea, but at the end of the day, it really doesn't matter. I'm actually going to grab my boots real fast, just so I can move a little faster. Grab one health potion, and we'll get right back into this lane now. So I'm actually, I'm actually going to teleport here, because I don't want to miss, you know, any minions that I can avoid missing. So, oh, I'm going to miss one. So we'll just drop one turret here just to kind of help us out. But I don't want to use the charges on all my turrets, so we'll just, we'll just leave it at the one here. Uh, and try and get these CS with our little candy cane wrenches. So, so far so good. Should be able to get that one and that one. And one more turret can go down, no problem. That's all gravy, baby. It's all gravy. So let's go ahead and set this right there. And start getting my turrets down again. Because, you know, we got some work to do, boys. We got some pushing to do. So what's up, Riven? Did you put another pink ward in there? You didn't. Good bitch. That's a good bitch. So let's see. Graves is bottom over by the dragon at the moment. That is good for us. Good for us. And honestly, as far as fighting her, fighting her is still going to be rather iffy for us. Um, fighting her up front, very, very dangerous in all honesty for, well, rather obvious reasons if you ask me. But, uh, wait, what are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Get out of here! The super turret has something to say to you, bitch! And let's go ahead and just, well, use that super turret to up the aggression a little bit. And get this rolling. So, ooh, nailing that stun. And that will be some good shit right there. Yes, sir, good shit. Throw another portal, or a little, uh, turret down right there. And let the Zots do what the Zots do best. And let's go ahead and just, uh, ooh, look at that damage just pounding it down on her. So bonk. And come on. No, the Zot's not going to get there in time. All right. Well, we got to set up all three of our turrets. And actually, what I just did there, not a good idea. Because having two turrets stacked like that, it does actually let Riven uh, kill my turrets a lot easier. What is Bard doing here? What is everybody doing here? Flashing out of that. Get me out of here. Get me out. Why are there four people top? I'm just, I'm just. <laughs> Why they send four people top? I don't, I don't get it. I, I just don't get it. We got mid tower and dragon off of that because, because they just sent everyone at me. And now I'll be back up again. I'll have a banner command and my Zerat portal back up. So like, perfect, perfect. I think I am gonna go for a Rylai's next. Either Rylai's or Zonia's. I'm thinking Rylai's is going to be the better choice here. Um, and I'm probably going to throw in, let's see, Ionian Boots, I think, would be a good choice for us. Because that does reduce our summoner spells more and lower our cooldown reduction. Which, cooldown reduction is a pretty big thing on what we want uh, as far as, you know, stats. So, good stuff there. Riven finally getting her first hits off on our turret. So, unlucky. Let's go ahead and see. Boop, get that. It looks like, what is, what are you doing here? What are you, what are you thinking? What? Are they going to try and three-man me? Are they? Is that what they're going to try and do here? As they lose their bot tower as well? Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh, I know you, I know y'all did not just. Oh, I know y'all did not just. Throw this super turret down. 
Get in here, bitch. And let's do it. Let's do it, baby. Boom. That's going to be some good damage. It looks like the shoe's on the other foot, motherfuckers. You guys have found a donger with a party behind him. It looks like they did get one kill right there. Misfortune getting the kill off on Riven. And let's, well, go ahead and get our Zerat set up here again. Just, uh, just real quick. And we'll get this. We'll actually set this right here. Because this is a good place to set it up. Um, for the reason being that people go to check in this bush when they see it coming out of there. And then they're like, whoa, wait, where is it? And they're like, ah, oh, jeez, darn it, it's not there. So... What the hell? What? Did she actually just flash? She she actually just flashed. Okay. I mean, I'll die with uh die with grace. But what? <laughs> I'm just actually baffled at the amount of resources they're dedicating to ch to kill me right now. Like I'm flattered actually. I'm much much more flattered than sad about it. Because sometimes getting camped is like, eh, that's kind of annoying. But right now it's just like, wow, I, I mean that much to you guys? Do, do I really? <laughs> well, let's go ahead and get back up top lane. Unfortunately, both of my actives are down for another minute. So, you know, we'll have to wait a minute before we can really get our dicks just out and flopping again. And we'll be, well... <laughs> we'll be very happily doing that once again here in just a moment. Let me go ahead and sell this. Grab a ruby crystal for just a little more stats. And we'll get right back up to this top lane. So, what the fuck is that? Is that a gingerbread rocket shooting flames all over a snowman's head? What manner of sorcery be this? But that looks like the... That literally did no damage. Misfortune's all supposed to do a lot of damage. That lit that literally did nothing. And she has five kills. What? That's not how that works. That's not how that works at all. That's not how that works even in the slightest. All right, whatever. Go ahead and just keep on dicking this ribbon here, in the sense that I mean, I fight without fighting. Because that is, that's what we do. That's what we want to do, is fight without fighting. So, maybe we can continue that trend. Now that both of our actives are back up, unfortunately, with uh, with the Banner of Command being the Banner of Command, it is, uh, whoa, it looks like, let's see this here. Get the fuck out of my face. Let the Banner of Command do its work. We're going to come in here, and we are just going to protect this banner. It looks like, what the hell? <laughs> Eh. Riven's turning into Riven. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. We were able to flash the ultimate, but we were not able to get anything out of it. Looks like Zed gonna come in. This this sh oh wait, the heal, dude. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. So it looks like Summoner Heal has been busted. The flash rend. Easy kill. And then Riven actually flashed to try and get the kill, but did not she didn't even get an assist. What a casual! What a casual! So we will lose our tower. Maybe I should just go bottom now. Start trying to push a different lane. So, let's see. Let's see. I think... Oh, that is... That was almost really good. It might still be okay, but that was... I mean, that was almost really good. But nope. That was a pretty good bullet time. Got stopped by Riven just running in there and key bursting or whatever it's called. And uh, stopping the misfortune from going off there. But we'll get these three turrets set up. Try and uh, just stop this wave of minions from going down. So to get this strategy to work a little better than it is this game, obviously we're doing a lot of work. Uh, we've attracted such a ridiculous amount of attention to our lane. Clearly. Uh, that it's really, really causing them to put a lot of effort into stopping my pushing. Which is exactly what it's supposed, like, this build is supposed to do. But, on the other hand, my team also really needs to be, um, you know, actively doing something with the pressure I'm creating. Because, unfortunately, my team is not taking advantage of everything I'm doing 
at the moment, uh, wherever I am on the map. Which is, I mean, it's unfortunate, but it's okay. So actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this banner down here. And I'm going to go teleport up top and see if we can get a Zerat portal pushing up here. Because if I leave that banner of command down there, unfortunately, Graves was down there. Yeah, he is going down there to clear it. Um, but I can get a push going up here with my banner with my Zerat portal. And banner of command will already be back up in a minute and a half. Should be relatively easy to get this going. So with everyone on the bot side of the map, we'll go ahead and put our Zerat portal here. Get our turrets set up way in the front. And as I get my Rylize, it'll be easier and easier for me to go and uh, try and fight with, you know, with me, within my turrets, within everything. And we'll go ahead and keep on pushing this in. So, should be, should be all gravy. I definitely should be able to get this tower with, with relative ease. So, my little Zot's gonna come in huge. We'll go ahead and grenade these guys, and boom, that's a rock portal damage. It looks like a double kill coming out for Kha'Zix, and that is not good for us, as the enemies will actually get a triple kill with, um, or for Callista. So, apparently, he's trying to surrender like a little fucking baby raging bitch. And unfortunately, my Zerat portal does not reach this area, but we are going to get this or this turret so I'm gonna drop down my big turret and see if we can get this a little easier it looks like Graves wants to try and do something to us here little does he know I am not having any of his shit so we'll go ahead and just back off now they will be getting our inhibitor but with them backing I can't afford to keep staying myself unfortunately so we'll see is this up it is not but my banner of command is, but it would be a very large waste, actually, for me to use it at this current point in time. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to go back, grab my um, Rylize, and we'll grab another Amplifying Tome to work on grabbing that, uh, the Zonias. That's the word. That's the one I'm looking for. But now with Rylize, we do slow. We do more damage. We do a lot of a lot of stuff. So... Let's go ahead and drop this here. Maybe not the greatest bullet time, but we'll still pay off. We'll still be fine here. It looks like... Whoa! Kha'Zix going in! It looks like... Eh. Eh. Come on. Eh. Please. Alright, she's slowed. She's super slowed. And... Uh-oh. I didn't stun her. Alright, whatever. Whatever. We'll go ahead and just... Uh, let's see. Whoa. Whoa, stop it. Stop that. Maybe. Dodge it. Come on, turrets. Alright. I lived. I did it. <laughs> I will live the exchange with Ari. So good job, us. Let's grab this Seeker's arm guard here and see if we can do something. So my ultimate is back up. I'm actually going to set my Zerat portal right here because that will help it from... Uh, or help the base from getting shoved in too hard like you know like it already is unfortunately but it will stop it from uh, doing too much so oh that's not what I meant <laughs> that is uh, not what I meant to do there in all honesty in all honesty I actually meant to cancel my ultimate so whoopsie daisies and such We'll be just launching my upgraded grenade out into the middle of nowhere. So let's see, it looks like the Bard ult will be going off there. And maybe, maybe, boom! That's going to be the stun getting that kill, baby! That's some good shit right there! And let's see, can we do something? I don't know! And maybe, come on! Alright, turrets! Alright, you know what? This is iffy. This is iffy. This is definitely iffy. This is very iffy here. So it looks like Ari just going to go in there, try and do some stuff to me. I will get charmed, and let's go ahead and drop the super turret down. We'll be dropping some pain, and I'm going to go down, but we tried to last as long as we could. Unfortunately, the turret defense will be breached. I will leak, and that's no bueno, no bueno. We can actually sell our Dorn's Ring for another needlessly large rod. We'll be getting us some more AP in here. And let's see. So, almost a thousand gold for my two items combined. Unfortunately, 
I think we actually do lose right here. So, it is what it is. I had a really good time in this game. Unfortunately, like I said, my team was unable to actually do much with the amount of pressure I was creating. Because even in the advantageous fights for them, it was still... I guess it was still too much for them. Because I guess our Zed is 3-12-3. A very rough game for him. And a huge misfortune... Uh, ended up having next to no effect this game. She was 5-2 and two at one point, and now she's 6-6. Six and six, So, not too bad, not too bad, not too great. Boom! That's going to be an easy kill before the game ends to get me even on the score. So just slam dunk right there. And unfortunately a defeat, but a very fun build nonetheless. And if you guys can get some coordinated friends in there, or just have a good time, you can do what I did and still, you can actually, you know, make it work a little better. So even with our strategy, we were still second highest damage on our team, third in the entire game. Um, wow, that Graves got carried. Even though he was 9-3-5, and five, he did the least damage on his team, but whatever, it happens. So bad games happen to the best of us, but still, I had a great time demonstrating that build. Hopefully you guys do try it and have a great time with it. If you guys did, in fact, enjoy this video, though, do make sure you leave a like and favorite. It'll just help me out. Um, if you want to, you can also suggest what champions I play in the future because right now I'm kind of at a loss. I have only, like, three or four more champions before I have played every champion since the experience thing has gone live. Uh, Heimerdinger was one of those couple. I think a couple others are, like, Xerath, um, Rek'Sai, Janna, a couple other people there. Um, but... So I'll probably be trying to do those soon, but if you guys do have any other suggestions, feel free to let me know. And as always, I love you guys. Have a wonderful day. Peace!